Okay. Hello, one. The Luminar here. And yes, we're back in Final Fantasy XIV Online. It has been a while since we've done this one. A very long while. So, the first thing I want to say the last part I did of this, part 154, it, uh, it vanished. The whole thing, the whole video just vanished. Either I didn't upload it correctly, or YouTube just decided to erase it entirely. I mean, honestly, it's not the first time this happened, because I, I had videos just suddenly disappear. I was like, okay, what? So yeah, I uploaded them, watched them upload, and it's like, yeah, they are there. And then they are gone. So, yeah, right now we, uh, we got more of the, uh, main scenario to do. And as you can tell, I kind of got a few, uh, few things on the side there lined up. I mean, honestly, uh, they're, they're not that hard. But what I am going to do is, uh, Okay, what is going on with... Okay, no. Okay. No, that's not what I need. Alright. What's the delivery Moogle I need? Uh, Moogle. Oh, it's it's right there. Ah! I'm the wrong way. Whoops. You, you kind of can't blame me. I haven't done this in a while, so yeah. Okay, so, nothing new. Nothing new. Alright, alright, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, so, uh, yeah. We, we got, we got quite a bit to do. Alright, so there's at least one, at least a couple seconds of lag. Honestly, I think the reason that I'm having this lag here is probably because, uh, I might have to uninstall OBS and then reinstall it. I don't. I don't know. I'll have. I'll have to figure it out myself. Cause this this lag of the uh, OBS is getting a little bit annoying. Just a wee bit annoying, you know. It's like I'm getting the delays more and more. I don't. Honestly, I don't know if it's from the uh, the overlay I have here or what. Ah, uh, you know what? Hold on. Let me check something. Let me check something real fast. Just, just one moment, folks. Just one moment. Honestly, no. Honestly, let's see now. Let's remove that overlay. Yeah, it's getting a little bit better. It's it's a little bit better now. That's good. That's good. Anyway, uh, yeah. So we're gonna be doing a few things on Final Fantasy fourteen. Whoops. No, I don't need that. All right. So first things first. Let's see now. Where is he again? Uh... Where's this blasted quest log? I know it's here somewhere, folks.
You know, let's just go through. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Ah, here we go. No, no, I don't, I don't want that. All right, yeah, just give me a second. It, it's been, it's been a long while since I actually played this myself. I did a, I did play a few days ago, helping out a. Uh, How about not a friend? The Sacral of Cafe Dicadia. Cause he's doing the he's doing a uh, a blind run of Shadowbringers and it's like Yeah Help you tank in the dungeon. Alright, so where is it? That's not the journal. Ah right, here we go, here we go. Let's see now. All right, so we we definitely got this going. Ah, here we go. There's a third circle. That's the which one is it? Okay, there it is. Wow, that was fast. Okay, not gonna lie. Alright, so yeah. We're gonna be doing that real fast. Just to get it cleared and out of the way and all, it's like, yes. Alright, if I can time this just right, I might be able to fix the whole look, the whole lag difference. Uh, and trust me, it's not going to be easy. Let's get the cutscene. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Alright. Off we go. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be a pain in the ass. All right, hold on one second, folks. And there we go, there we go. Yeah, I moved when I should move. I know. Ah, 
Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Doing some Final Fantasy shenanigans. Just getting some things to clear up that had to be cleared up. And yeah, if my, uh, my character model's turning weird, that means I'm kind of turning to the side because my, uh, my OBS is giving me a little bit of a lag here that I can't seem to fix. Oh, I'm just mostly getting some of the stuff taken care of anyway. After I do this dungeon, I'm probably gonna get a different camera to use, so that way it's actually facing me instead of my side. Yeah, it's like, uh, yeah. Well, that was a fun experience. I mean, Final Fantasy XIV always has shenanigans. Though it kind of wasn't as... Like a sad girl's reaction to the whole uh, body horror thing of Shadowbringers. Now that, that, was gonna, that, that was a little bit funny, not gonna lie. And yeah, his reaction was understandable. It was like, I kind of had the same reaction myself. Honestly, I don't think anyone could have seen that one, especially from a Final Fantasy game. That was a little bit closer. No choose coming at you. Yeah, I was kind of shocked about that too. But Shadow Bring Us was so good and the soundtrack was amazing. Alright, neat. You killed it. Pass on that and pass on that. There we go. Down the hole we go. Last supper. No, I had supper like an hour ago. Thank you very much. I can swing my sword, sword, cause I'm a tank, tank. Tankity tank, tank. I'll see, I'm not gonna lie, it kinda looked like something from Resident Evil or Silent Hill. Ah! I've been turned to a seed! Leave me alone! Ah! Let me bury this guy! Come on! There we go. And like I said, if you're gonna see me doing this a lot in my head and everything, it's like, yeah, cause uh, 
Yeah. I have a lag between the OBS and the uh, game. Which doesn't help when concerned doing the fact that I have to be a tank. And I kind of need to, you know, be able to keep up. Ah. Uh. Ow, oh, that was bad. Honestly, though, speaking of stuff with seed and all that, I'm I've, I'm kind of been tempted to just go through a Persona Persona series again. Like honestly, I could probably start up Persona Four Golden again because I was starting because I did start a playthrough of that a while a good long while ago. Back when I was in the uh, Misfits Discord server. Honestly, I probably might do it again anyway, because I like the Persona series, alright? I could probably do a whole run through of Ah! Ah! Leave me alone! I don't want to be planted in the dirt. Ah! I'm not a young sapling like when I first started Final Fantasy XIV. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Oh. I hate that. Right then. Come at me. Oh my goodness. Really? Really? Ah, uh, How leafy- that's, that's just- wow. Honestly, honestly I haven't- Having chat actually, you know, moving like this and all, it, it kind of helps a little bit, because, you know... I, my, my chat kind of doesn't really move that much sometimes. Come on now, come on. Yeah, no, I, 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 I would legit do the same thing with the puns. If I wasn't the one, uh, being planted. No, not that way, not that way. Ow! Come on, we got this, we got this. Yeah, buddy. Leave me alone. Oh wait, you don't have to worry about being turned into a seedling again. Nice. Alright. Pass. Pass, okay. You guys should really wait for your tank. Oh yeah, no, I do the same thing. 
Well, honestly, I make terrible puns when I'm hanging out with others. But I, it, it's it's hard to resist making the puns. Oh my goodness. Ah! I couldn't get the right command going. Oh. Alright, so, yep. Yep, yep. Ah, uh, this hurts my neck. <laughs> pass, pass. All right. Yeah, but when someone tells you to stop, that means you just gotta do more. More for the horde! More! <laughs> oh, yeah. Honestly, I would have started this earlier, but. Th things kind of came up, and I was like, yeah, no, yeah, no. I'm gonna do as much as I can anyway. I at least want to get the rest of the, uh, Final Fantasy IV stuff taken care of, too. So honestly, honestly... Ah! I got pulled. Oh, thank goodness. They pulled me away from getting transformed again. Oh, I would have lost my flipping mind there. I don't need to be green, I'd rather beat the greens. Funny enough, next Friday is uh, St. Patrick's Day. It's like, hmm, huh, hmm, yes. I be an Irish man myself. We're getting flooded here. Honestly, today does kind of feel like Friday, but at the same time, it doesn't. Honestly, it kind of feels more like it's Tuesday. Okay. There. Ah! Really would be nice if people could, you know, wait up for you. Especially when you're the tank and you're the one who has to keep them alive. Alright, let's do this. Oh my goodness. Is is that thing what I think it is? Oh my goodness, it's a giant pile of... Well, talk about getting down and dirty. Getting down and dirty with this. Oh! <laughs> Filthy! Honestly, I think it's a, some kind of sludge slime monster. But it kind of looks more like a giant pile of. Yeah. You know what I mean. And you know, I'm not wrong there. 
Oh! Ow! Uh oh, I'm in trouble. Okay, there we go. Oh boy. I'm fighting poop. Poop. Ah, poopy. Listen, listen, I can make the jokes far, far worse. But no, no, I'm being nice, I'm being nice about it. No. It's what came out of Mara. For those who don't know, it's from uh, the Persona series, the thing that looks like a giant hot dog. goodies. Darn. Alright. Oh, we got that taken care of. That, that was... Ooh! Huh. <sighs> nah, the cracker went backwards. It wanted to get away from that thing, so it went back into... It said, lock me up. Lock me up! Ah. Uh. So I'd rather be locked up than deal with that. Midnight Dew. Okay, so that thing was just a giant bad ooze. Yeah, no, the face, it kind of looked like a... Really bad spoiled spoiled chocolate peep. Oh, oh! I want. I kind of wonder how bad I ruined the peeps for everyone for right now. Oops. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, to be fair, that's kind of what it did look like. So yeah. Hmm, growth formula. Hmm. You know what? I'll take your entire stock. Who said I'm going to be using it for plants? I got something more diabolical in mind. <laughs> ah, I got a kink in my neck. Okay, yeah, one thing, one thing I do want to say, I'm pretty sure a lot of people encounter this. Oh, hold on. 
Now, why are these two choices so mean? I can't. I can't say that to the little thing. It's. It's. Oh. Ah, oh, it's too mean. I. I can't. I can't say it. Ah. Oh. What are you gonna make me do this? All right. I'll. How about a. How about a bit of pruning instead? Oh, hey, that was actually the right choice. Now, anyway, what I was going to say was... <clears throat> I'm sure there's a lot of people out there who's been dealing with this when they post stuff... Post the links on Twitter when they're doing Twitch streams. And suddenly you get a message like, hey, what's this? It's like, oh, it's from a digital artist. Hey, I want, I want you to commission me. Hey, commission me. Commission me. I started a stream and I was like, hey, you should use my stuff to be even better. It's like, uh, one... Think about how much the person has, money-wise. Two, you're coming on way too strong. Three, your art is good, yes. Was like, let them come to you instead. Don't push it. I'm sorry, but I, I've had too many of those happen already. It gets vastly irritating. And yes, the digital artists and stuff like to put themselves out there. That's understandable, but not everyone's going to have the money for it, especially when you ask for a hundred plus dollars worth for a commission. It's like, uh, yeah, some people are going to be extremely but tight on the budget. You need to think about what they're going to say before you kind of approach and start saying, hey, commission me, look at my stuff. I can make your channel better. It's like, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, huh. I'm sorry, it's just, that's one of the things that really annoys me the most. It's been, between that and all these loot tubers showing up at the start and then, I don't know, not even a month later, it's like, hey, they're affiliated. Nice. Good, good job with that. Then another month later, hey, the partner is like, are you kidding me? And yes, there are people who work hard for that. But when lewd tubers kind of do it, it's like, uh, yeah, that kind of pushes all my wrong buttons the wrong way. Alright, let's see now. Is that for one of my... Oh, it is. Okay. So we gotta go that way. Our Choco Chie! We need you! Fly, buddy, fly! Fly, fly, fly! Yeah, buddy. But no, yeah. The, sh the short of it is... It kind of gets a little bit irritating seeing people, you know, use VTuber models that are severely oversexed. It's like, yeah, I know, sex sells, but you're kind of making a hurl way, way too ridiculous. A boom shocks. Oh, yeah, definitely. Parent plan or something? Yeah, it's understandable. But sometimes, uh. <coughs> sometimes you kind of do need to put things to the side. It's like, okay, I, I have other priorities that do need to be taken care of, so. I I'm gonna say thank you for letting me know about this, but I'm gonna pass on it. And if I choose to do it again, I choose to commission you or something, I'll let you know. It's like, yes. That, that's the kind of response that should be done. It's just when some people just come on it so thick, it's like, oh my goodness. <clears throat> Ugh. Sorry, it's just some, some of those things kind of irks me a little bit, and I end up ranting about it. Go 
crawlers. Alright, now we gotta deal with bugs. Bug, 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 bug. Buggy. No, it's not Buggy the Clown, it's just bugs. At least we can make a quick work of these things. How do I have only three slots of. Oh, right, because the, uh. I remember now. Because some of the stuff from the dungeon got into my inventory. And I kind of have an inventory problem because, you know. I, I, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, I'm what I like, some would c call the, uh, the hobo adventurer. Because, you know, I kind of, I have no home. I just wander and wander and wander. Yeah. <coughs> and so that was taken care of too. Oh boy. Oh, all right. Just need a moment. Oh. Yeah, it's just... Uh, there's, there's some people who got to remember, there's boundaries. you got to respect them. Do not cross any lines that are not meant to be crossed. Respect thy boundaries and respect thy lines. Then all shall be good. All right, now then. Right. Duty Finder. Wait, hold on. Before I do that one, before I do that one. Yeah, let's do this one. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, wow, wow. You're over there. Okay. Let's go. I believe I can. <coughs> <laughs> Ow. <coughs> I think I strained my throat a little bit. Uh. No singing for me. I leave that to professionals. Ah, hardy har har har. That's a good one. Ah, uh, but no, I didn't expect to suddenly choke on air. Yeah.
Well, then again, I'd rather choke on air than choke on a drink. Uh, it's even worse when it goes down the wrong pipe. It's like, ow. Oh. oh, yeah, no, it's it's much worse when it's due to something that's actually funny. It's even worse when you're drinking something and someone says something hilarious and you go, spit take, here. See what I've been drinking. Everyone will love it. I was like, hmm, yes, huh, yes, huh, yes. Ugh. Yeah, I want to try something. Let me, let me try something. Yeah, it's just like a thought. The lag's there. Alright, let's see now. Oh. To Adolshire. You know, it could have been worse. It could be worse. I've seen things that should not have been seen that have should remain unseen, but was seen. End of scene. Uh, I'm gonna take the gold pieces. Cause I need gold. I need gold. Gold number. There you go. There's your pickaxe back. E. We're knocking down the list. Alright, so I gotta find out what are we having in inventory right now that's kind of screwing us over. Oh, yep. Yep, that, that would do it. I mean, uh, yeah, it works in Pokemon, but if you're playing Rejuvenation, that's a different story. It's like, oh yeah, someone already beat them and you only get in the pocket change that stuff. It's like, really? 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 Alright, so... So, discard that. And discard that because I don't need those anymore because I got plenty of those cards. Let's see now. Uh, yeah, a lot of these coffers I don't need. Okay, I gotta sell this stuff. Merchant. Oh, this way. 
Okay. Found him. Alright, so. We're gonna sell those. Oh, oh, there's, there's a lot of fan Pokemon games that's really good. Yeah, some of these I should probably take care of. Yeah. Yep, so uh, we got we got stuff sold. We got stuff sold that needed to be sold. Alright, so what's next? Oh, they're right down there. Well then, off we go again. Ah. Ah. Help this. Oh my, yeah, I kind of forgot about all the uh, markers here. Yeah, that's, that's gonna be a thing. Problem is, I can't fly yet either. Yeah, no. Not here, anyway. I, I kind of haven't gotten all the uh, requirements done for the uh, flight. I gotta go that way, don't I? Yep. And to be fair, to be fair, it could be a lot worse. Like, oh, the early days of Heaven's Ward. We had to go through a middle of a giant map just to get one marker. It took like 15 minutes to get to. Okay, now why did I give up on this one again? <coughs> oh no, I remember why. I, I remember why. I just can't find the stuff on here. Seriously, where are the where, where are those things? Wait a second, hold on. Hold on a second. Hold the phone. 
I can figure it wouldn't let you do that. Ah. I gotta find out what's going on with this one. This is really driving me up a damn wall. Alright. Come here, phone. Let's see. Alright, yeah, that would probably help a little bit, too. So let's see now. Go on. Let's see now. Okay. Now, how do you get this blasted mission done? I'm gonna lose my freaking mind if I don't figure it out. That doesn't tell me anything. Are you joking me? I sit there for like five minutes and I it doesn't do anything, and then it just decides to come and attack me. Alright. Let, let me let me check something real fast. So folks, it's just gonna take a minute. Wait, hold up. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Are you joking me? No wonder I could never find it. It's all the way up there. Are you kidding me? So I gotta get up there. 
It's like, yeah, they give you the markers, but they don't have it be where you can get up there. It's like, are, are you kidding me? I was like, yeah, sure. Make it even more difficult for those who don't who don't have all the Aether currents yet. Oh my god. <sighs> I hate it when it does that. Like no joke. Found it. All right. Let me jump. Let me jump. No fun. I want to jump. I mean, I completely break my everything, but it'd be worth it. Geronimo! And I broke my everything. Still alive. It's just a whole bag of broken bones. Them bones, them bones, them broken bones. Uh, Aussie, Aussie. I fear for ha whoever has to do this one next with being in the same situation as I am. Like, my goodness. Go away, foul beasts. I do not need your attention. Oh, look at fate. I'm gonna join it. Ah, I am the medic. Yeah, it's even worse when the medic decides to jump off. It's like, uh, me medic? Are you still alive? Medic! Medic! Well, I think we need to replace with medic now. Hey! Nailed it! I had helped the person because I wanted to. Really? Yeah, no, you can go after right off. I ain't dealing with that, no. Oh, well, you're on your fifth minute this week. We're on a fifteenth. That's just in three days. I ran past it. I hate it when it happens. Oh. At least we're getting somewhere. And also, we are out. We are at the one-hour mark as well, folks. Hope everyone's having fun. If you think others might enjoy it, you're more than welcome to share the link. Let's keep the fun rolling and going, shall we?
It's a giant lizard. Class complete, okay. I mean, it would be nice if they did, if Final Fantasy did a little system where whenever they did another, uh, increase the level cap again, where well, all the XP you accumulated over throughout all the adventures be like, okay, here's all that EXP all at once. Or we could turn it into money for you. It's like, here, have one tenth of money out of all that experience. It's like, uh, yo, thank you. Instead of just doing missions, be like, okay, I'm losing all this EXP. I, I can't I can't get that EXP because if I change classes it's gonna be too low and it's like well crap. Alright, now then Duty finder, duty finder, duty finder. Aha. To the third circle dungeon. Or raid. Whichever. Because we got to take care of these circles. Yeah, it's like, yeah, okay. So all that wasted EXP, it'll just... We'll have one tenth of it go to your other classes. There you go. It's like, nah, man. We're gonna make you waste all the EXP and then use and find ways to get the other EXP for your other classes. It's like, uh, see, so yeah, ow, why? Ah. <sighs> Ugh. All right, so since this is gonna be a good few hot minutes, yeah, there's a couple blue markers here that I definitely gotta do. But yeah, the uh. Yeah, getting the uh, EXP for the extra classes would be nice. I mean, look at that. Would you look at that? I need all that leveled up. My goodness. I mean, heck. If I join with a couple people who would, you know, go through the dungeons and unsync, just drag my side booty through, they'd be like, hey, free EXP, three, three levels. Thank you very much. Come on, gun. It's like, uh, yeah, I, I'd rather get dragged along and get my class up like that instead of being like, oh, right, grinding, yay. As if Final Fantasy doesn't make you do grinding enough as it is, especially when you gotta grind for, oh, you know, items, armor, inventory stuff, weapons. We're just going through all that on top of the EXP you need and the gold you need. It's like, why do you do, why do you do us dirty like this? Why do you do us dirty like this? It's like, yeah, I know. It, it's called Final Fantasy. It's been so much grind since the first game. I should know. It, it would, it's, it's pain. Lots and lots of pain. You know, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be extra silly. Hit withdraw. Okay, how about oh let's see now what would be a good example? Uh hmm. How about Final Fantasy three? I was like, you're going a little underlevel to a dungeon. A certain dungeon. It's like, oh, 
you can't enter here until you're at this level, which is 15 levels higher. Go grind up. It's like, oh, why? It's like, yeah, no, yeah. Like here, Final Fantasy IV, you need these powerful spells to help finish the end of the game. Have fun grinding to level 80. Especially when you go at level 65. It's like, oh. So many headaches. Okay, yeah, Steam, stop being so mean to me. I know I have over 15 things of my wish list on, uh, that's on sale. Yeah. Yeah, stop, stop with that. Oh, no. If you want to talk about the horror of Final Fantasy VII, yeah, hmm, let's see now. How about before you have to get to the end, before the end of the first disc, you have to get a certain uh, party member to have the skills up to max level 4 before they're gone forever. Just so you can have it. It's like, R really? Are you, are you going to do this to me? Really? Why must you ho torment us like so? And I'm not really getting anyone here. Oh, it's only been a few minutes. God damn. But yeah. Seven was a good game. It's just that they could have done a Cloud a lot better. Cloud kind of just, uh, first two discs goes through some serious develop character development. Neat. Third disc. Oh, we're just going to erase all that. Have fun with that. It's like, are you joking me? That was just ouch. You know, and then there's ten. It's like, ah, uh, why? And then to top it off, there's 13. And yes, I'm, I do like 13, the first one. Yes, I'm going to admit that. And yes, I'm going to admit, I do like Lightning. She's amazing. She's hot. Don't judge me. It's just, they ruined so many developments with a lot of the characters and stories and everything. Ah, uh, it makes me sad. It makes me sad. Though, I think we all can agree that the one game that kind of screwed up the most is uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 06. Yeah. That was the biggest oof ever. I had to play through it from beginning to end. Just because I wanted to see the story. It was pain. <laughs> it was pain! I mean, there's there's some things you there's some things you should do and some things you shouldn't do, in that poor poor Sonic game. Oh, let's you know how about with Sonic 06, The whole main issue is because they were trying to rush it so fast, like they were cramming everything together, crunch time after crunch time after crunch time, and people were like, nope, done, leaving, nope, done, leaving, nope, done, leaving. It's like, you can't blame them. I'm like, there's a whole article and video about the whole Sonic 06 situation. Wow, try saying that six times fast. I think I almost broke my mouth a little saying that. I need a drink. Ugh.
Okay, we don't talk about Elise. We, we just don't talk about her right now. Though, another thing that could be... Okay, I'll put it like... I'll put it like this. I'll phrase it like this. Okay, so... I have yet to play The Last of Us at all. I've not played anything of it. And they've made how many remakes of it? How many times? And it's like, okay, yeah, one remake. That's fine. But you don't make five and just keep beating the dead horse. And then, oh, we're gonna make a TV show out of it. Are, are you joking me? And yes, it's, it could be good, yes, but it's like, you, you beat the whole series down so bad that people are just sick and tired of hearing it. It's like, well, this character has had the most tragic backstory. I can name out 40 different characters from five different games who's had it much worse. Do not try to think they are the best or the most tragic. There's worse. And there's some that's actually had vast character development. Let's go. Uh, yeah, no. Sadly, I'm gonna have to bounce out of that one. Oh, and there's also the one for Steam as well. And Xbox. So it's like, yeah. Yeah. Oh wow, all the way to Old Dog? Yeah, and I also came out on PS4 as well. It's like, uh, why? timing is way off because I haven't done streaming in a while and actually try to <clears throat> you know focus on it oh my neck is gonna be so dead honestly funny thing funny thing I do have the uh Steam version of Final Fantasy XIV. Yeah, uh, Detective Pikachu and uh, and how they made Sonic the Hedgehog, the first the two movies, they did amazing jobs with that. But yeah, like I was going to say, I do have Final Fantasy XIV on Steam and everything. I haven't watched The Witcher or played it, so I kind of can't say anything about it. I, I don't judge until I've seen or played it. I, I kind of I kind of gotta play The Witcher, all of them. So yeah, I can't say anything about The Witcher. Uh, like I was going to say, I do have Final Fantasy XIV on Steam. It's just I don't have the Endwalker expansion. I was like, yeah, I, I can't, I kind of can't do anything else on it for the Steam version because, you know, uh, they make you rebuy everything. It's like, why, why not just have it be universal tied to the account instead of be like, oh, you're going to have to spend this much and this much and this much you have to rebuy it it's like why would you do that why hey dirk 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 dirk
it's all not <sighs> excuse me Okay, yeah, I can't say anything about 12 because I, I haven't played either version of it. The PS2 or the PS4 version. I, I kind of got to go through those. The Final Fantasy games I haven't finished Or Okay, let's see now. Perhaps we should avoid talking about that here. But yeah, as I was going to say, the Final Fantasy games I haven't finished or fully played. I haven't finished... I haven't finished 5, 8, I haven't played 9 yet, and I haven't played 11. Uh, so, yeah... Ah, <sighs> uh. but yeah. I mean, honestly, even though Eleven's offline, it still has a story you can go through. Cause. One of my friends I knew, well, one of my friends I know recently played it just to go through it for fun. And it was still up. And they did that about, I think, what, last year? Half a year ago? I was like, hmm, I'll, I'll have to take a look into that because. Yeah. Honestly, I kind of wish that Forte would bring back a lot of the past uh, events. Like, you know, Shunt. The uh, Final Fantasy XI tiny event, because I want to see Shantoto. Let me see her. Alright, now then. The little all amigo. Ah. Uh. Okay, I need a moment. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. 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 Like everything popped. Ah. Uh. Whew. Uh. Yeah, it, it kind of doesn't help when you, uh, when your whole body stiff as can be.
Uh, honestly, let me, let me check something real fast. Just, just one moment, just one moment. Okay, so of the ones I know that's streaming, there's only two of them doing that right now. Cosmo Violet Nova. Okay. Alright, now then. <clears throat> Whoops. I'm hitting the wrong buttons. Alright then. Choco Chai, we need your assistance. Ah, poop. I forgot about the wall. Yeah! Fly! Oh, no, wait, hold on. Almost. Yeah. Where, 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 where do you go? Where are you, buddy? Is it me, or is my chocobo running a lot faster than it should be? Uh. Okay, who gave my chocobo some of the, uh. Space Gacial Greens. I kind of need him, uh, you know, on Earth. Not, uh, you know, going supersonic fast. Down. Down, buddy. Down. Oh. Collapse color. <sighs> My spleen. You're on your back. My spine. I can't resist. Oh boy. Oh. Well, to be fair, to be fair, I had an angle where I couldn't tell what kind of person they were so that 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 one's on me <laughs> that one is on me water and food okay let's get them some snacks snacks and some drinky drinks hehehehe <laughs> Alright. Now where would it be hiding? Where or oh, where could that little bag be? Where or oh, where could it be? Uh huh. Right, we're going to the sky. Easy there, Chocobo. Easy. Easy. Uh. Thank goodness there's no police around. I don't want to get a ticket for the speeding Chocobo. <laughs> Oh, seriously, where is that bag? Hold up, hold up. Okay. Uh, now, let's not say that. Because then you'd be saying I'm riding on Sonic and oh my god, or what did I just say? Why did you make me say that? Found it. You son of a... 
ったーああ、なびっくりした、が clipped。All right. You said it. I was writing on a chalkboard. Now you made it sound like Sonic, like I was writing on the doll. I'm not saying it again. Hey, Rahatia. Good to see ya. Please, please don't. Please, 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 please don't. Oh my god. I just had an even funny idea. We should have Kazu draw something like that. <laughs> it's like, hmm, yes. <laughs> the idea must be shared. Let the others know. Tell them about the new mount as Sonic the Hedgehog for 14. Let's see who can come up with a better idea of riding them. <laughs> You'd be like, who can mount Sonic the Fast? Oh my goodness. This is getting out of hand. I'm sorry. I was like, hmm, yes. I think we should stop talking about mounts and uh, mounting and stuff like that. And mountains. It's like, hmm, yes. I kind of need a bigger audience, though. Because I want to get the comedy going. Oh, my goodness. My face hurts now after thinking about that. Yeah, I know I said it at that time. But you know, it's kind of hard not to unthink it now. Seven heavens and seven... Okay, I've heard of the seven hells, but seven heavens? What? How do we get with seven heavens? I mean, I know the old show is called Seventh Heaven, but seven heavens? Uh, huh. If we're going to talk about seventh, can we can we see a Yuffie or Tifa or maybe this or maybe Fourteen's incarnation of Earth? That'd be nice. I'm follows. <laughs> Gotta love it. Okay, so let's see now. Let's 
Neat. Alright, so when you go... Ah, there it is. Alright, Chocobo, time to go speedy speed. the entrance it's a little dot question mark question mark question mark the umphalos oh yeah that's right I don't remember what this is now okay hey cryo we gotta talk with you I think I turned my model so much it kind of almost broke. Honestly, I kind of want to do something for my model. It's kind of been the same since I first got it. Honestly, now that I think about it, when did I start doing V2? And hold on, I know my V2 anniversary has got to be coming up soon. Oh, let's see now. Channel. Like this. Let's see now. Huh. Would you look at that? So it's not until, uh... Not till June. I'm getting pretty close there. Just a few more months. Nice. June 15th was when I started VTube, and so when I guess to June 15th, that'd be my one year anniversary of VTube. And I mean, it'd kind of make a little more sense if I had it going. Consistently, but it's like, yeah, it's fine. It's it's still VTubing. All right. Are we gonna have <coughs> are we gonna be beating up more gods? Because if so, then let me get my beaten stick ready. Okay, yeah, seven heavens. That makes sense. Yeah, what does pass at last mean? Yeah. Yeah, beating up gods is the normal for uh, Final Fantasy. Same with Dragon Quest. And Shin Megami Tensei. And Tales of series. And Blaze Blue. Yeah. There, there's a list. 
Ugh. No one people have trouble with those sometimes. It's like we keep beating them to death. Okay, I haven't. I okay. I haven't played Xenoblade one or three, and I'm nearing the end of Xenoblade two. However, as I was about to get ready to finish Xenoblade two, uh, now Celestine says no. You have to go and finish Xeno Saga. I mean Xenoblade one, because it'll have a bigger impact. It's like son of a why? Ah. Uh. You know, fair enough. Fair enough. And plus, she's not wrong. She's kind of the Xeno expert on this, on stuff. You know, Xeno Saga, Xeno Gears, Xeno Blade. I was like, yes. Xeno Nell. I mean, wait, what? Ah. <laughs> uh. I can't help it. I, I like coming up with different fun nicknames for people. No harm, roll foul. I mean, to to be fair, I kind of, I kind of was the one who gave her the idea for the Nelvit name and art idea when they were doing a uh, Tales of Viseria. That that one that one was on me. I couldn't help it. I all I did was just change one letter. Ah. Like when I when I do fun nicknames and all that, it's like yes, I make sure to keep it fair and understanding. I don't cross any lines. It's like hmm, gender. Whatever your gender is, whatever you choose to be, whatever race you are, I don't care. We all have beaten hearts. We got blood in our veins. We got brains in our heads. That's all that matters. Yes. Ah. Uh. Mm. Monkey. He's got a monkey on his shoulder. Well, okay, I know it's not a monkey, but I like to say it's a monkey. Monkey. Uh, no, I'd rather be a Saiyan, you know what I mean? Because <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, I've been watching too much DBZ Abridged again. I love that series. It's getting hot in here, so hot, so take up. Nope. Nope. Ha! Ah, me by my lonesome. The reason I haven't done the main scenario stuff yet is because I know it's going to be heavily voiced. And it's like, yes, I don't want to interrupt that.
Oh, there he is. Found you. Ah. Uh, like when I when I play stuff that has a uh, a lot of voicing in it, I make sure to go full quiet cuz you know I like to hear the voices that's done by the uh, VAs that put that brought the characters to life and everything. Let the hard work be heard. Now, honestly, if my voice wasn't as bad as it is, I'd uh, I would actually try to be a VA. It's like, nope. Without as bad as my voice is, I just tear people's eardrums off. Nope. Hey, we got that completed. As much as I want to do that again, uh... Let's see if we can actually get the third circle going. Because in that way, uh, yeah. Alright, less than five minutes. Let's see if we can get it going in five minutes. Five minute delivery. Deliver me unto the raid. Ah. Uh. Ah, oh, plus I can use this to rust out a little bit. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Uh, wow. I was just kidding about the little less than five minute thing. What the hell? Uh, I was like, okay, five minute wait. Okay, sad, relax. I'm like, okay, time's up. Like, wait, what? That wasn't even two minutes. Holy crap. Uh, uh, can, can I, can I get it? Me a genie? Or a gin? Either one, or both. All right, let's do this. Power! Team up! The Phoenix Mythic Creation. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Time to fry a mythic bird. Yes. I'll take both. Tank Buster. Ow. That hurt.
Oh my. Oh yeah, we gotta kill these birds. Or is they gonna roast us? No Phoenix Fire for you. Come on. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Yeah, sure, you can get a side of mashed potatoes and honey mustard. Ow! What happened? Wait, hold up. How did that happen? What happened? How did the Phoenix Fire go off? We stopped the phoenixes. I'm so confused. Oh my goodness. That explains it. I didn't see them. I didn't see them. Uh oh, time to hide. Let's try this again. I'm gonna roast this bird. Uh oh. Woo! That was close. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, come on.
Oh, thank goodness, we stopped it this time. Or not? Oh, okay, so I need to split the ads. You know, that, that kind of would have been nice to know, uh... <clears throat> nice to know ahead of time, because there's probably some people who haven't done this before. Ugh. Can't exactly say anything, because, you know... Don't exactly have the keyboard or anything to do it with. Yeah, it's just, uh, it's like, it would have been nice, no, some people in the party here actually said something about it. It'd be like, okay, yeah, so you're gonna have to be ready to do this at this point. It's like, yeah, that, that'd be, that'd be nice, that'd be nice. Since, you know, there's people who haven't done it before. Ah. <sighs> What happened? Oh. I guess someone snuck off and we weren't looking. Okay. Okay. That, that, that's what happened. Ah. Oh. This is gonna be fun one. There we go. Got far enough away from them.
Okay, thank goodness. We didn't get wiped this time. Okay, good. I knew this was going to be challenged, but wow. Uh oh. Time to run. Despite how crazy this fight is, I'm really liking it so far. It's really making you think. And move! You know, I like to move it, move it. Come on now, come on. Come on now, come on. Where'd it go? Uh oh. Ow. A little bit more. I mean, it would be fun if we were in Madagascar. I was like, nope, we're in Final Fantasy Hell. We almost got him. We almost got him. A little more. Don't let up, don't let up. Brazil, I'd rather go to Japan. Yes, we got him. We got him. Oh, no wonder that bird had three heads. What the hell? When did it become Ghidorah? I 
I mean, you know, I was kind of, you know, vying for my life trying not to get party wiped, so, yeah, I couldn't see it. Plus, there was so much fire, I could only see, you know, one thing, not three. Ah, that, that's kind of hard to notice. Especially between the three tails, four wings. It's like, you didn't expect it to have three heads. Oh, let's see now. Eh. Whatever we get, we'll get. And also, we're at the... Okay, yeah, then I didn't notice it. I only, I only noticed the one head. I thought it had six wings. And also, we're at the two hour mark as well, folks. I hope everyone's having fun, still. If you think others might enjoy it, you're still more than welcome to share the link. Let's keep the fun rolling and going. Do 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 do. Ah. Of Uh, yeah, we're more than just the uh, regular trespassers, trespassers here. We're trespassers. Because we got the sass. Mm. We got trash. We got trash. And oh my goodness. Call him a dim wet. The bile rises in my throat. Sir, just take some mouthwash. That would clear all your problems. And by that I mean don't spit it out. <laughs> oh, I can resist. I can resist. Just take the just take a good old strong healthy Wig and chug of a uh, mouthwash. Just don't, uh, you just swallow it. You don't spit. Ah, I know, I went a little dark there, but it was fun with it. Well, 
Worth it. And yeah, you just you're just cleansing your insides. A little heat never hurts. Uh, are, are they melting? I think they're melting. But was that too much heat? Oops. Yeah, I, I think this guy might be a little bit too strong for us right now. Solar Flare! And we out. I'm a familiar. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. He, he is my pay grade. He's like, listen, listen. You're my pay grade. I will destroy you, and I get a house. That's the deal. You are my pay grade. I can finally have a house. I don't have to be no more the hobo tank. No more being the hobo tank. Ah... I wanna have a home in Final Fantasy fourteen. Ah, really materia. Ah, we'll just grab one and go with it. Who wards the wardens? Warders. Oh. Okay. I saw that R is an N. Wait, that's Lot. Whoa, hold up, hold up. Wait, what? La Habreja's son? Whoa, wait, what? Hold up, hold the phone. What? What? He had a kid? Uh. Who? How? When? Who? What? I'm. Yo, hold, hold on. Let, let me let me get my brain back together. It's like, um, yeah, uh, um, hmm, uh, what? I, I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. Huh. 
Ah. Athena? What? Oh, wait, what? Ah. <gasps> ah. Uh, uh, I. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, yeah, um. Ah. Uh, Uh 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 Okay, uh hmm Yes Yeah, no, no, I, I, I have overloaded. Yeah, no, this guy's kind of a little bit too powerful for us right now. Yeah, if we can just go up and beat his face in, that'd be, that'd be fun. That'd be fine. Yeah, we, we, got, we gotta find out why he went to mad, uh... I don't know. He's not a scientist, really? Researcher? Uh... Breeder? Creator? Let's just say he's mad. He's mad! I want answers too. I gotta find out what drove him to do this. Oh, if you knew the adventures we went through, Themis, then you could write a book about it. Let, 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 let's not tell him. Let's not tell him. Oh. Let's not tell Eric there that we, uh, kind of off his old man. I don't think that'd be a good idea to tell him. I mean, yeah. But then again, we're kind of from the future. And this is in the past, so it's like, hmm, yes. Yeah, time paradox. Gotta love it.
Yes. Timey wimey stuff. Oh, the fourth circle. And oh, we got that taken care of. However, I want to do some of the main scenario quest stuff. To Raz Atan. So I gotta find out what happens next. It's driving me up a wall. The thing is, the reason I haven't done any of this off screen is because I've literally done all this adventuring from the start on stream. I'm not gonna deny this from anyone. It's tradition now. Ugh. Honestly, my neck might be saying a different story. Ten find zero. Where is she? Oh. Back there. Okay. Up we go. Rounder. Alright, quiet, quiet on set, quiet on set. Everyone is so carefree. Unafraid and unconcerned in spite of their weakness. And how easily their lives could be torn apart in an instant. Such luxuries are lost to us. We have no hopes or dreams. And even the release of death. Only hunger. Others are a means to an end. At times, a literal one. We forge covenants with men and come here to feed, or to die. 
I thought it would be no different when I was summoned by Xenos. Lives were tools to him, to be used and discarded at whim. In that respect, he was a void sent at heart. But towards you, and you alone, he behaved... differently. And I cannot fathom why. What was it that drove him? What made him choose such an end? But enough about that man. He is dead and we are all better for it. Why are you here? Was there something you needed? So you're heading back now. Then as per our bargain, I will go as well. Neat. That was fun. And gotta love the voice. And I, I really do love who they got to do Zero's voice. Amazing! And I'm gonna be lazy and just teleport to the crystal. I don't wanna walk. Close up. All right. Cutscene. Quite, quite on set. Quite on set. Everyone is here? Good. Let us set forth for the void once more. What is it? He's calling. What is the meaning of this? Unless I'm mistaken, that was intended for one of your kin. Who? It was for the briefest of moments, but I felt her. Ashdayer. I thought she was in the void. As did I. Yet the presence was unmistakable. Thus did I call out, only for it to fade and vanish. Perhaps she crossed over to the source, then immediately turned back. I do not know. Could she have found a way home? The how of it aside, if she was indeed in the source, there may be clues where she came through that could lead us back to her. Where exactly was it that you felt her presence? Far to the north. That was all I could discern. The north, you say? Beyond the bounty, Garlemwald. As good a place to start as any. 
My apologies, Zero, but your return to the Void will have to wait. I told you before that I have no reason to go back there. Do as you will. All right. I presume you wish to stay here in Radzat Han until we return? You've kept me amply fed. I wouldn't be averse to helping you on your search. If Ashdaya was indeed here, other Void Scent may have made the journey as well. Very well. We would welcome your company. If it's decided, then I'll contact our associates in Garlemald. It's me. Still talking everyone's ears off, I trust? Understood. We'll see you there. We're to rendezvous at Tertium. We'll need to teleport to make it there in time. Can you? I... I know it well from my time as an Avatar. Then it seems we're all set. If there is nothing else, let us see to our final preparations. Gods rebel, lands tremble. Quite complete. A cold reunion, huh? Off we go. Oh, uh, cutscene. Quiet, quiet on set. Or not? Okay, that was just a long teleportation. Okay, now we got the cutscene. My friends, it is good to see you again. And you. I was worried that the cold wouldn't agree with you, but you're both looking quite well. You get used to it. It helps that there's no shortage of fuel and heaters like before. Glad to hear it. Have you been working in Garlemald all this time? We have. Though the worst is behind them, the people still have a long road ahead. With the nation in ruins and the leadership void yet to be filled, there remains a lack of direction, a pervasive sense of aimlessness and worry. Still, everyone wants to make things better. And we're here to help. A lot of Garleans wanted nothing to do with us, but they're starting to come round. Slowly, but surely. You're doing a fine job. You're too kind. But it's thanks to the cooperation of like-minded souls that we've been able to make any progress. 
the Allied nations continue to send supplies, which allow us to meet basic needs such as food and shelter. Meanwhile, Eulis and a number of soldiers have begun a restoration initiative, with more and more volunteers joining by the day. Like Alphano said, they've got a long road ahead of them. But we'll get there together, one step at a time. But enough about events here. What brings you to us? And with new company, besides? This may take rather a long time to explain, but bear with me. The 13th? After traveling to the edge of existence, I thought you'd keep your escapades closer to home for a while. But I suppose there's no stopping you. Not that I'm one to talk, of course. The heart of an adventurer cannot be denied. You could have at least invited me, too. Surely there was room enough for me and Grahar in the Undersea Vault. Uh, yeah, uh, mm. Yeah, Alice, I love you, girl, but I, you, I didn't think, okay, we, we kind of were kind of on a tight schedule and, uh, didn't know where you were and, uh, yeah, yeah, sorry. It's fine. You can make it up to me on the next one. But on a more serious note, are we sure it's wise to keep Xenos' former avatar around? I understand how you came to work together, but nevertheless... I... You're right to be cautious. I'm a void scent, after all. But do not conflate me with Xenos. To recall my time in his service, it angers me. Is that so? I think we'll get along just fine, you and I. Now that we are all caught up, to the matter at hand. As we were about to resume our search in the void, I felt the presence of my sister Ajdaya in the source. Somewhere in the far north, perhaps even here in Galdemal. If you have seen or heard anything out of the ordinary, I must know. As a matter of fact, we may have. In recent days, we have had to contend with a surprising number of voids and, and not the lesser kind that occasionally manifest, but ones possessed of considerable power. You think they might have been summoned? By whom? We're not sure, but as Eulis reminded us, Practitioners of a certain traditional Galian art rely upon void sent servants. The very same I believe you have mastered. While there are no known reapers left in Garlemald, we can't rule out the possibility that some are working in secret. To summon not one, but several powerful void sent is no small feat. But if Ashdaya was indeed called from the void... Then it is likely the same party is responsible. Alternatively, the etheric confluence at the Tower of Babel may have triggered an expansion of natural fissures one could use to cross over. But I think that improbable, if not impossible. 
then we must assume these events have indeed been orchestrated. Well, summoned or no, we've been trying to track them to their origin. It's the mountains to the east, we think. Can you guide us there? I would, but the terrain is too difficult to traverse on foot, nor is flying an option due to the winds. Too much ground to cover in any case. Is there no way to narrow it down? There is one place we thought to look first. An isolated village rumored to have once been home to a Reaper order. That would indeed make an excellent start. Though the question of how to get there remains. Eulus may be of assistance. Let us return to Camp Broken Glass and consult him. Ah, yes. That was good. That was very good. Uh, I still gotta map out this whole area, too. Ah, uh, thankfully, we don't have to go that far. Oh, uh, let's see now. We're almost up to three hours. My neck's starting to hurt. A lot. So, yeah, once we get this, uh, part of the quest done, then we'll, uh, then we'll call it a stream. Alright. Quiet on set. Quiet. Or not. God damn. Why? 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 Oh yeah, no, we don't we don't need any uh we don't need any uh supplies this time. We we just need to find a way to get north. Smart guy. Yeah, I may have picked it up, but I'm gonna keep quiet and saying who it was. <laughs> Cause why not? Okay, so we need uh, snowcraft, snowmobile. Tapper is done, huh? Ah. 
Yeah, sure, I'd love to travel with Ali, say. Go on a date with her. I mean, wait, what? <clears throat> Sorry, I, 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 I kind of love that woman a little too much. I don't care. I like her. Alrighty, so... definitely going to call it a stream here yeah we almost made it to three hours we got a lot done but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take care of a lot of stuff off screen you know Get that taken care of find a way to keep myself from breaking my neck more because ow but yeah for those who are watching thank you all for joining I hope you all had fun if you liked it you're more welcome to hit the follow or subscribe button if you'd like. That's all to you. And uh, before we go, I'm gonna I'm gonna set up a raid. Yeah, it'll, it'll take just a moment, just a moment. Okay, so yeah, we're going to raid Cafe Darkadia. Because why not? Plus doing a labyrinth of a, of a Galliera. So, uh, let's read them. So, till next time everyone. This is Luminar, and I'm heading off. And I'll see y'all later. Boop. Put the command in. There we go. Laters.